Hello, welcome to another studio vlog for November. Thank you so much for joining me and thank you so much as well if you have subscribed to my channel. I have hit over a thousand subscribers, so thank you so much. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe because it really helps me out and give this video a thumbs up if you like the vibe of this channel. And yeah, I'm just really excited to hopefully inspire and motivate you in your own creative journey. So let me know if you have any requests for any videos in the comments. This month's focus is mainly getting ready for a market that I'm doing in December. Now, I don't normally do end of year markets because I sell scarves, so I'm not really sure how many scarves I can sell in summer. But as you can tell by my attire, it's November and I am still wearing a jumper. Uh, it's really, really weird weather. We'll have like a 30 degree day and then it will go down to, you know, 18. So if you don't believe in climate change before, you probably will believe in it now. It's been really, really weird weather. So hey, end of year, it may still be cool enough for scarves. But I'm doing a market in Loberthal, which is in the Adelaide Hills, and they get the lot of people coming through for the lights of Loberthal, which is all the Christmas lights. So this year they're actually doing a twilight market, and it's on the Saturday and Sunday, I think it's 18th and 19th of December, and it's from 4 till 10 p.m. So that'll be a very interesting market. Uh, I'll take you along with me in the next studio vlog. So make sure you subscribe so that you can be notified when that comes out. But in the meantime, I am quite low on stock. So I need to make plenty more scarves. I think I've got enough plant holders now, so that will be good. And I'm also going to be drawing some more of my herbograph drawings because, you know, for the first time, I'm going to have those at the market as well. So. That's my November and yeah, let's get into it. Loom is a dream to walk up. What is it? Yep. Because my one at home, the big one at home, takes me um, about half an hour to walk up. You're a dream loom. This is my dream loom. But they don't make any more. I don't know why. <laughs> wow. That's even more dreamy, isn't it? I know. You just know you've got the last one. I don't know why they don't make it anymore. The thing I love the most about working out of Collective Haunt is that I get to chat to other artists while I'm working. So here I'm having a chat to Sonia Unwin, who's in the next studio, which is always inspirational, always good fun. I am warping up this loom for, sorry, the dream loom, as Sonia said. I'm warping up this one for a small skull tapestry because they're very relaxing and fun to weave. And I'm also going to be planning a larger tapestry made up of smaller tapestries but I'm sort of formulating the idea for that while I'm weaving the skulls.
it is Saturday the 6th of November and before I go to the gallery I'm just going to stop off at the coolest gallery in Adelaide Hugo Michel gallery as Troy a friend of mine has got some work in there so I will show you inside We visited our friend Tam's block at Currency Creek, which you may have seen in a previous studio vlog, which I'll link up above. And uh, she was there with her boyfriend, Chris, and we had lunch and Tessa thought it was the best thing ever. So it's a really, really beautiful block. She's got glamping tents and she's going to be building a house on there, hopefully within the next six months to 12 months. Carrying these eagle wings with her Aperol spritz. <laughs> this is the sunset bar. <laughs> you right, Tessa? Tessa living her best life. <laughs> so earlier you may have seen me hem stitching the wall hangings that I was making. So it's a bit of an experiment because I've never made wall hangings before out of hand woven fabric, but they turned out 
really well. So I got these really nice, you can see it, little hangers and they're made from Tasmanian oak and they are so beautiful. And I have left a fringe, which I don't normally do. Yeah, I'll insert a proper picture of them, but today I'm going to take them to Collective Haunt to photograph them because the lighting at the haunt is so good that lots of people tend to take their artwork there to photograph. So I'm going to do that with these. They'll be listed on my website if you are interested. So in the description box, there'll be a link where you can purchase them if you so wish. You, you beautiful boy. Yes, you are. Beautiful boy. <coughs> Is she in your bed? <laughs> oh, you oh, are you bringing her a toy? <laughs> oh. Yeah, I'll swap your toy for my bed. Aww. the zoomies. Love it. Thank you so much for hanging out with me in this studio vlog and as I mentioned at the beginning I would really love if you could subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up and I will see you in the next video. Bye!